welcome to my vlog. I can't say weekend vlog because actually today is Monday. So basically I think I'm probably going to chat with you guys for about almost six days. I've missed you all so much. As you know, last week I would have been vlogging, but we were in Phoenix visiting Zach and Caitlin, enjoying Easter week with our children. We got home Sunday night, so I thought I would just uh, check in and say hi. I know how much you guys enjoyed some of my grocery haul, so I thought I'd share a few things that I picked up at the grocery store today. And yes, I've got the hair uh, I did cut some of it off I felt like it was a little too long for me so uh, I have a couple little curls in it and I'll show you the back of it um, as this week goes on but uh, thank you all so much for your kind comments it made me feel so good I'm loving this hair it feels so comfortable and so natural we'll talk again more about that as my week goes on so let me share with you my groceries as I'm putting them away and making dinner Okie dokie, so tonight we're gonna have, just because I just, you know, we got home and this is so much easier to make, and this is the Atlantic Salmon with seafood stuffing. Nice and easy, I got this from Sam's Club. I'm gonna whip these up, they just go in the oven for uh, like 20 minutes. A little bit of Asian chopped salad. Um, I'm, of course, gonna put the dressing on the side and just try to be really um, light on the dressing. And then I'm also going to make, talk about, a I don't, uh, a lot of veggies, but these are cauliflower pearls. I love these so much, and I'm gonna make a, like a fried rice with these. So actually, it's not rice, but these are, almost look like little pieces of rice. So I'll show you the recipe uh, when I'm, as I'm making that. And let's see, what else did I get? I got some coffee. Mark loves this darker coffee, so I got some coffees, uh, some more oranges, some avocados. And uh, what else? A lot of pork chops. I'm getting ready to repackage these up so I can freeze them. Of course, bath tissue and paper towels. I love these little tomatoes. These are so delicious. Um, for salads, I bought a lot of lettuce and I already cleaned all my lettuce off. And I made one of my Weight Watcher cakes. This one has uh, it's a chocolate fudge cake with a little PB2 and some yogurt and water. So this will be today's dessert. I'll show you the dinner um, as I'm making the fried rice and I'll show you when it's all done. All right, you guys, here is the fried rice. I'm gonna be pulling out the salmon here in a minute. Oh, we're gonna check it out and got the Asian slaw. So it's gonna be delicious. I'll let you know my thoughts afterwards. happy Tuesday Lauren's on her way over here so we're going to film today I feel like we have not filmed in such a long time upstairs in our studio and uh, so I've got my hair curled my makeup on this beautiful top actually from Kohl's that I took to Phoenix but I never wore and my beautiful Kendra Scott Joel's we're doing our favorites video so you guys will see these on that video Hmm, you probably already saw this video. So, Archie's ringing the bell. I'm gonna take him out and I'll catch up with you in a little bit. Lauren and I are done filming. She just left, she had to run some errands and I just got my Young Living Essential Awards order. And uh, I got this Nixia Red. I'm so excited to try this. Uh, you know, you take, I think, two to four ounces a day or once or twice a day and um, it just gives you energy and I just filled with so many amazing things. So I'm gonna start using this and I'll let you guys know what I think about it. And I also got a carrier oil so I can make my roller balls. So I'm really happy uh, that this finally came in so I can make roller balls to give to people and like for allergies and migraines and stress relief and all that. So I'm very pumped about that. And let's see, Lauren and I just had leftovers from last night's dinner. She loved the cauliflower rice so much, so I'm really glad she enjoyed that. So I'm going to go ahead and get dressed, or get out of these clothes, get on some walking clothes. I'm going to go walking with Jody. And did I show you guys? I'm not sure if I showed you these this morning. These are the two necklaces that I got from Kendra Scott when we were in Phoenix uh, from the wedding collection. So um, if you didn't, uh, if you want to know more about them, make sure to check out our video that we posted um, on Thursday, yesterday. Well, whenever you're watching this, on Thursday when we did our April favorites. So I'm going to go ahead and get changed and I'll check in with you a little bit later.
Well, I didn't chat with you guys on Wednesday and Thursday. Well, actually, I brought my camera, and when I went to turn it on, the battery was dead, and I think maybe it went on in my purse and drained the battery. So it is Friday. Um, so Wednesday, Lauren and I went to Ann Arbor. We uh, doggy sat my daughter's dogs because she was uh, on a work trip. And uh, so we did a little shop and went to Sephora and spent our 15%. The VIB Rouge sale, and then we went to this really cool boutique. Uh, it's called Lily Grace in Ann Arbor, and bought some more goodies. So I want to show you those real quick. But we had a really fun trip, uh, just a lot of laughs, great food, and um, now we're back home. And I'm waiting for the construction people to get here. I'm not sure if I told you guys, but a few weeks ago, our basement flooded. Our sump sump pump started stopped working, and um, Anyway, we got flooded. So up goes the carpet and the baseboards and all that. So I've got people coming today to actually replace the baseboards and the carpet should be in in about uh, another week or so. So I've got a lot of people coming over here today, but I thought I'd check in and show you some of the goodies. And I do, I did have the other camera, so I did take a little footage of the one short store that, I can't even talk, the one store that Lauren and I were in. So let me show you what I got. Okay, so Lily Grace is a really upscale kind of a uh, boutique as far as you know makeup and skincare um, they also have you know uh, like nest candles I love molten brown so I'll show you here I've been wanting this diffuser by molten brown uh, the scent of this one is cocoa and sandalwood and I can tell you oh my gosh you guys it smells so good I'm going to do a full review on all this in the video Lauren and I uh, the other thing I picked up is the Kevin O'Conn. This is the Neo Bronzer. Um, I got the Sienna. Look how gorgeous that is. Lauren got, I can't remember the name of the other one. Uh, this by Terry T. Detan. Oh my gosh. I'm going to show you this. A full review as well. Love it. Uh, Sephora. What we picked up there was the, I love this, uh, by Sunday Riley. This is the Brightening Enzyme Water Cream. I needed more. I got that with 15% off. A gorgeous lippy from Bite Beauty. Another lippy from Kat Von D, a brand new shade. I got the Lancome Hypnos Drama. Elizabeth and James Arvana. The, hold on, my phone's ringing. All right, so back to this, Elizabeth and James. This is the dry shampoo. I chose the white, Lauren chose the black, so, and they both smell so good. Um, we both got the Mon Paris, the YSL uh, new fragrance. This fragrance smells phenomenal. Oh my goodness. So, uh, yeah. Okay, so also I wanna show you guys. We got a PR package from Luxaton. Good all, oh, I didn't tell you guys. There's so much I have to share with you. Um, Caitlin is moving home. Did I tell you that? From Phoenix, she was very homesick. So Luxaton. We uh, got this PR box from Luxaton. We were so excited when they reached out to us. So we got here, let's see, this is the, okay, hold on. This is the almond milk concentrate. Uh, so I'm excited about this. this. is something you put on after you get out of the shower. 
after you the company's the uh, the oil which you guys know how much we love this oil and this is the also um, another oil that is it's a little more of a it's a light it's a fine body oil and it helps uh, with skin feeling smoother and this one is a foaming bath by Luxaton. Never tried this one before, so I'm excited about Lauren and I trying that. Um, what we do is I'll try them for a while, then she tries, and this is how we get to uh, try them out and do a video for you, all these products for you guys. This is the Divine Cream, and um, this is uh, a face cream, obviously. And let's see what else. Perfume. This is a new perfume that just launched April 12th. And oh my gosh, can I tell you, it smells phenomenal, phenomenal. So here's the perfume. And of course, some shea butter hand creams. So I'm so excited about that. All right, so what else? What's on the agenda today? Well, I've got the construction people coming over to put the baseboards in, like I said. Um, I've got our orchid man, our little kind of pest control for little spring bugs that will be coming out. So we have him come so we don't get any of those critters in the house. And uh, I'm not really sure what we've got going on tonight, but uh, I'll try to touch base with you guys um, in a little bit. Hope you're having a great weekend. Oh my gosh, it is 4.30 and I feel like I didn't get too much accomplished today. We have the construction people there. I got the baseboards put back in. I'm waiting for the orchid man to come. He's way late. So now Mark's home so I can run out. I'm getting a shower gift because I have a shower to go to tomorrow. Friend Kim, Mike and Kim, uh, their daughter Corey uh, is having a baby. It's going to be their first grandchild. So I'm really late in getting this gift, but I know exactly what I want to get. So I'm off to his boutique. It's a really, really cool boutique. It's called uh, Chic Chateau. And uh, they've got like really just gorgeous outfits for little girls and boys and I just know it's something she won't have so uh, of course my phone is ringing it's my sister so I'm gonna chat with her and I'll check in with you guys here in a little bit I just love this store. All right, you guys. Well, it is uh, almost six o'clock. We're gonna head out here, um, grab a bite to eat. Not sure where we're gonna go yet. And if I don't check in with you guys tonight, I will tomorrow. I'll show you my outfit tomorrow and uh, before I head out to the shower. Alright guys, we're at one of our favorite breakfast places for dinner in the kitchen post. This is country fried chicken liver. Look at that. That looks amazing. We've got catfish tacos and pork tacos. A bit of kimmy. I don't know what this is, Jody. Um porchetta sandwich. That looks amazing. I don't know. Gary got some kind of a pork sandwich there. Jody, she got also the tacos, butter wine. Really, really good. Delicious yeah, dinner. All right, and this is the perfect okay. summer drink, you guys. Lana and Kubel's is Kimmy. Summer Shandy. How good is that? All right, I'm going to pass this around. Anybody uh -uh. want to check it out? Are you kidding me? I would never Somebody have to travel. Alright you guys, sorry about the lighting, but I'm all ready for the shower. I got my new top, I think this is NY, um, Inc, INC. Uh, I got it at Macy's. The lighting is making it orange a little bit here in my bathroom. So I just got this on, maybe it'll be a little bit better now. And uh, I got some, just some black dress pants and uh, my Lucky Brand shoes. I'll try to show you in the mirror.
guys happy Sunday it is a gorgeous day today um, um, showered and actually um, right in front of I just pulled into TJ Maxx home goods I'm gonna look for some pillows and just a few little outdoor decorative pieces for a deck mark pulled out all the furniture yesterday it's gonna be a gorgeous week spring finally has shown up here in Ohio so we are so thrilled and then I'm gonna head to the grocery store I think we're gonna make burgers tonight I'm not sure what else I want to make but I'm sure I'll find something while I'm at the grocery store we had a lot of fun last night at the winery with Mike and Cam the music was so phenomenal it was just fun night just relaxing sipping on some wine and listening to music and just chatting with friends so um, so I'm gonna head inside TJ Maxx and see what I can find uh, to spruce up the deck area a little bit because you know how I love to make it look like a little outdoor room so let's go check and see what they've got going on inside home goods Guys, I wanted to show you what I picked up from TJ Maxx, but I'll show you once I get home as well on the deck the pillows that I got. These are so pretty. And they come as a set here. It's a pillow accent set. So I cannot wait to put these out. And I also grabbed this Morgan and Grace. It's a strawberry coconut diffuser. It's gonna smell so good. Okay, some orange panels that are wrapped in here, so I'll show you those when I get home in a cute t-shirt dress. So, I'll show you everything. I'll give you my grocery haul when we get home. show you guys what I picked up from the grocery store so let's head over here I got some more of my favorite vanilla biscotti coffee this hummus I love hummus just for like veggies I love my pickle stackers you know I put these in my uh, all my turkey sandwiches I love the I can't believe it's not butter especially this time of year when well not this time of year when summer comes um, for corn on the cob Cubanelles, Mark and I love to fry these up uh, just to have on a side, as a side dish, they're so delicious. Some strawberries, raspberries, um, blackberries. I got this yummy Greek mousse that Lauren, I hope you guys remember watching our, um, I think, empties video. And I thought, oh, I gotta try it, it looks so delicious. Fresh basil, some more of my cauliflower pearls. And I got some lean turkey and some ham, bananas. Um, this is my treat sometimes. I allow myself once every couple, but once a year, like Twizzlers. I love them, especially chocolate. I know it sounds gross, but really they're my favorite. Um, baby spring mix, my flat out. 
for my wraps for lunches. I thought I'd try this one, the Artesian Thin Pizza Crust, the flat out. So this might be a good for dinner one night. Um, lots of breads because uh, Kate's, you know, obviously coming back home. So we got some like muffins and um, got some buns for tonight's burgers, which I probably won't have mine on a bun. And I got this really delicious bread. I'm going to make Mark some French toast with this. The French sliced broche, or I'm not sure how it's pronounced, but I thought this would be great for French toast. And then basically my fresh um, cilantro, basil, cilantro, and um, what else did I get? Oh, scallions. So I'm going to clean these all up and put all these in the fridge. Oh, and some pasta. You know, we've got to have some pasta in our house. So, all right, I'm going to get all these groceries put away, and I'll check in with you all, all here in a little bit. Oh, and these veggie straws, sriracha. Oh my gosh, these are so good. I was eating them in the car after I, of course, put sanitizer on my hands. And here are my tulips. It's such a gorgeous day, you guys. I'm going to get all this put away and go sit outside on the deck. And I'll show you my pillows and all that once um, I'm dumping all this away. I wanted to show you guys how I make my uh, make ahead of time French toast. And then uh, basically I freeze it. And then whoever wants it, they can just put it in the toaster and uh, put a little uh, syrup on. So this is what I did. I just mixed together some egg, a little vanilla, cinnamon, and almond milk. I'm using my uh, little electric skillet here. Those are the last three pieces. And I've been letting them cool on some parchment paper. Then I'm gonna package them up and put them in the freezer. So I just used some almond milk and some eggs, cinnamon, and vanilla. So that's simple and easy. If you make a whole loaf, uh, put them in the, in the freezer and you're good to go. And this is the bread I used. So this should be really delicious. All right, I got the pillows out over here. This one's over here. We gotta fill one of our tanks up here um, for actually our heater. So we have to do that yet. Oh, Mark's watching the calves, so they're in the playoffs. And uh, there's the candles, the two orange candles. I got the one here, and I've got the one over here. And then these pillows here I'm going to put out in the front. We're going to go to Home Depot and Lowe's here in a few and try to find some new chairs for the front. So, here we are. Things are going to start to fill in here real soon. Remember how I showed you guys last year? And it will fill in each week. It's so beautiful out and so peaceful today. I love it. All right, decided to just go simple and easy. I am going to have a bun because I am starving. So here is dinner, a yummy burger, little tots, and that is it. Simple and easy. And I'm going to go dig in. All right, I want to show you guys. Look at our chairs. This looks so homey and cozy. Love our chairs. I got the pillows on them. Got the candle holder with a candle. I gotta put a candle in this lantern yet. And of course, I'll have um, some flowers in here and then flowers hanging up here once, of course, the weather breaks a little bit more. And then my, oops, my flowers and my window box. So it looks really pretty. I'm really happy with it. So this is the first, the beginning stages of uh, getting everything just all ready for summer. I love it. Well, good morning, you guys. Actually, it is Monday morning. Mark and I were so exhausted last night. I fell asleep and forgot to end my vlog. So uh, I wanted to just get on here this morning to say I'm sorry about the... I feel like it was just so thrown together. As I really was so excited to have a great vlog for you all. And then, you know, we just got so busy. And then I went to Ann Arbor and my, my camera battery died and I didn't bring the charger. So... Um, I don't even know what's on this vlog. So I started uploading last night. I'm like, I don't even remember doing half of this stuff. You know, how you just go through every day to pick up the camera. So half the time, you forget when you vlog what you actually vlogged. So um, we have a lot going on this week. Um, you know, with Caitlin moving back home and uh, 
It's supposed to be weather-wise just so beautiful. So we're gonna embrace this weather. I'm gonna spend as much time as possible outside. Um, today, it's Monday again, like I said. So I'm just really just getting things organized. I did so much yesterday. I felt like I'm ahead of the game, which is great. Lauren and I are filming tomorrow. I'm getting my hair uh, touched up and my nails done tomorrow. And we're filming tomorrow. And uh, let's see what else. And right now I'm actually doing some roller balls with my um, oils, my Young Living oils. I'm making up roller balls, one like for headache, one for allergies, one for like pain relief, uh, you know, muscle, sore muscles and stuff like that. So um, I'm gonna do those here this morning. And let me see, I just whitened my teeth. Uh, a video is coming out soon on this. Uh, let's see what else. And um, I think that's really about it. But uh, if anything I forgot, I'll just share with you on my next vlog. Uh, I just have so much going on. Like I said, uh, we've got a busy summer, so you guys will come along for the ride. But as always, thank you so much for just hanging out with me. And um, I you just appreciate you guys so much. You have no idea. And um, I hope that you have a wonderful two weeks. And I will see you two weeks so Open until eye. then take care we'll see you the bye cut through hypnotized by the sounds of breathing and hold tight